I'm Castano, I am still in Kuala Lumpur and today I'm in an area called Putrajaya In this area there is a nice pink mosque, like really cool bridge and loads of monuments and it looks really cool on Google so I decided to just come here because I listened to Google To get here I had to take the tube and then I had to take the train and it was actually quite expensive because the tube itself was like 5 ringgit and the train was like 14 ringgit one way so it's kind of expensive I am currently walking to the things I was supposed to take the bus but I don't know when it's coming and I was waiting for quite a while so I decided just to walk it's about half an hour walk so it's not that bad I don't actually remember the last time I was proper exploring on my own you know what, today is the first day I'm on my own exploring the city and I actually really really missed it because I can do everything at my own pace and space space baby so we are really close to the bridge as you can see and it has a lake as well and everything is supposed to be across that bridge so that's where I'm gonna walk and here is the bridge I don't know how to explain to you guys but from where I'm standing it's actually massive on the camera it's obviously you're watching it from the screen but in real life this bridge is giant so this is where we can see from the bridge we have the pink mosque the bridge and the lake just here and if we guys look out to the other side you probably won't be able to see much but there is some sort of big bowl as you can see orange one and some more buildings there is literally so many business buildings around here so it must be like a area for all those people who work in finances and stuff like that we are again really close to everything now I've walked only about 15 minutes here we have the pink mosque and this building over here guys is the prime minister's office so we're gonna get a little bit closer to show you more as you can see here the area is really clean like it reminds me kind of of London but better it's kind of like Queen's Palace in London but this is like Asian Malaysian country <laughs> what do you think would happen guys if I decided to go in the middle of the street to take pictures do you think I would die because of the cars or do you think I would survive I'm gonna go and take pictures from the middle I'm in the middle of the road guys I'm actually standing on the road trying to avoid the cars and that's kind of really easy because there's not many around And this is what I'm talking about guys This view is absolutely stunning And we are finally here And there's the mosque just here So we're really close So this is what it looks like from the front And it's really beautiful Can you guys imagine I'm trying to take a picture of me And the castle And people are coming randomly to me Asking me if they can take a picture with me Like are you for real? I'm just trying to have some fun Take pictures of just me, myself and I And people just want to include me in their pictures But I guess of course because I'm actually starving and I know somewhere here is supposed to be the food court and I'm so excited because I can smell food where is food? food come to me food come to me oh yeah where is food? food come to me yeah. to me yeah. to me hell yeah so I'm really really close to the mosque now and it looks really beautiful. I mean, look at these patterns here. It looks really incredible. So this is the entry to the mosque. And look at this door, it looks so incredible. I mean, I love everything that's kind of this style. It just looks so beautiful. So mosque is just at the back and now we are going to the ministry office. So this is the prime minister's office. I mean, I don't know, I just love this building. Green. So now I'm leaving this place, I might go to the other side but I'm not sure how long it's gonna take me It's not that late yet, it's about 6pm and my journey back will take me about 2 hours So if I can stay here for 2 extra hours then I should make it home fine However, to go to the other side, I have to walk, it's gonna take me a long time, probably I don't know, so I don't know what I'm gonna do yet So today I already took selfies with 4 different people, I mean do I look, really look so different today? Because I didn't think so, but everybody seems to just be like really interested in me and taking selfies, so... So here we have a massive building of the Ministry of Finance, as you can see. And this road is like super busy, but super colorful and beautiful. And these amazing flowers in the middle, it just looks really cool. La 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 
la la, I'm walking in the middle. La 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 la, I'm gonna get in trouble. Look at this bus full of pollutions. Uh, okay. So I'm now on the other side, guys. I just wanted to show you what is the here, and as you can see, it's like a big needle. I'm gonna call it a needle, because to me it looks like a needle. Don't really know what it's for yet. And that's the big bowl that we saw, which I'm also gonna check out in a second. So basically here it's like a park. So if you're feeling a quiet day and wanna walk around, this is actually a perfect place because it's got like this amazing lake and lots of people walking around. That looks really cool. And right now we are entering a needle. Okay, I'll be honest with you guys, I am too lazy to walk all the way up. So I'm just gonna chill here, the view we have here. There's another bridge over there. And the well-known needle, <laughs> which I still don't know what it is. So if anybody's from Malaysia, from Kuala Lumpur, and they know what this needle is all about, then please comment down below. Remember when I was telling you about this big orange ball? It's basically a massive balloon. Check out this weird thing. It's made out of tires. These are the tires. Bottles. And some sort of lights. Which that looks so cool. Basically the moral of the story is that there's nothing really interesting on this side apart from a giant park. So if you want to rock around, you go for it. I'm gonna head home now. I have about half an hour walk. Then I have about half an hour train drive and then about one hour tube drive. So I'll get there in two hours, which is so long. But anyways, thank you for watching this video. Like this video, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. I'm pretty sure I need to get somewhere over there. So I'm just gonna take this shortcut. Now watch me whip. Watch me nay nay. Now watch me whip, whip. Watch me get up this hill. Somehow, I don't know how, but I am struggling right now. Guys, help me. <laughs> okay, 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 okay.